So um, we'll get going here, guys, with this. And uh, basically, the majority of this uh, live today is going to be about the presentation for the new opportunity. And uh, this is the first part of the presentation I put together for you guys here. And these are uh, some points that we're going to be talking about. So, uh, you know, what I believe this is going to be is a solution for FOMO. So we'll talk a little bit about that. Um, there's a great team environment and um, a look to the past, uh, handle your funds. Um, do you take on risks? That's a very important thing uh, when it comes to trading, like how much risk do you actually want to take on? And then company future goals. So I'm going to pull my phone out of my pocket because I just realized if uh, someone messages me, then I can actually see it just in case maybe the recording stops or something, right? Okay, so we'll get going and we'll roll right into this uh, presentation. Also, I have a piece of paper. So if you hear a piece of paper rumbling around beside me, it's just my notes um, that, I, um, that I'm going off here, okay? So let's get going, guys. And the first thing here I wanna talk about is um, FOMO. So this is a big thing of like, why would you want to use a bot? Why wouldn't you go out there and, you know, um, you know, there's things like, well, we'll take S Group, for example companies like S Group where you're sending them uh, the funds and then they're basically doing everything for you. You don't have to mess with the things that are going on in the background, like the actual trading or you know the stress involved with that and all that kind of stuff, right? So in trading, most people fail because of a fear of missing out, meaning that they actually don't even end up placing trades or they enter the market in a totally wrong spot, you know, which they didn't plan on doing. So that's FOMO, guys, is fear of missing out. So this happens when a trader feels uh, unease uh, due to the fear of losing a potential profitable trade. And then, uh, and the result of that, they never end up taking a trade or even worse, enter the market at an unsafe, bad position. So a trading bot basically eliminates FOMO, the fear of missing out. Because if you think of a trading bot, guys, they're selecting where to enter into the market. And then also you can close out the trade on your own, but they can close out the trade for you at, you know, potential, say you say, I want to get on average, let's try and get 1% per trade. And then when it hits 1%, they're closing the trade out for you. So it can be totally, um, you know, hands-free type thing, but that fear is still there, but it's not as bad when the, the uh, robot is looking for the entries and it's, you know, figuring out where to sell them all, all that kind of stuff. So that is probably my number one thing when I think of, you know, from a promotional point stand of view or, um, you know, why my, you know, why would I want to do this? It's basically to eliminate uh, fear, fear of entering the market, the fear of like getting started in your trade. And uh, yeah, it can be pretty fearful guys when you're first starting there, okay? So next slide here. So this is very, very interesting. Um, I picked this up in uh, from the Vadim webinar there, guys, that he did um, this, this, I believe it was the start of uh, this last week here or the end of the last week there. But this is really, really cool concept here, guys, for the new um, platform there. Uh, it's not replacing S Group or anything. I did have some people message me saying, is this going to replace S Group? Uh, no, it's not, guys. This is a totally separate platform that they're making here. It's not uh, part of the S, uh, S Group website, not part of the S Wallet, not part of uh, S Trade. It's its own separate thing. Um, it's going to have its own separate uh, referral system. But your referrals that you have in S Group will be like connected to the new uh, system, try uh, AIX, okay? So it's gonna, basically when you go in there, you log into your account, uh, you're gonna see your team inside your account. So something similar to uh, how, you know, when you logged into um, uh, uh, S-Trade there, guys, you can see some of your guys in S-Trade if you shared your link with your team. So it'd be something similar to that, except they're already going to be in there. So you don't have to go and share your link and, you know, hope that people from your team, oh, you know, go and join you and stuff like that, guys. They're already going to be in there. So it's going to basically, if you already have a pre-existing team in S-Group, guys, this, this uh, is going to be already all set up for you. And that's freaking amazing, right? So team environment, um, you know, that awesome team environment that uh, Sergi and the other top leaders provide for us inside S Group, guys, with all the support, the Telegram groups and all that uh, great communication and stuff. 
um, it's going to be there with uh, the new uh, trading bot system as well, right? Okay, so it's pretty awesome. And then, of course, your S group team will be automatically moved, automatically moved um, to the uh, new uh, trading site. Okay, so it's pretty awesome if you think about that. That's that's great. So the next thing here is the odds are with us. So this is something that was not talked about at the the Vadim webinar, the last one, but I thought it was a really, really, you know, this is something that we should all think about is because here's the thing. Okay. If you've ever promoted anything before or done anything online, we all know that joining launches or joining someone's idea is kind of, you know, if you're thinking about you have a big following, you have, you know, people that join you in opportunities and they, they trust the decisions you make and stuff like that, then most likely joining a launch or the idea of something and then jumping on board with that's probably not the smartest thing to do. So this is something that I thought about here, guys, which, you know, gives me the purpose, the reason to sit here and even do this, right? To do this presentation for you, because, you know, if you know me, you know that normally you don't see me out there promoting stuff that hasn't even launched yet. Uh, normally in my first presentations that I do, I'm saying things like, hey, this is why I chose this company. It's blah, blah, blah years old. Hey, here's the results from it. That type of thing, guys. And you don't, you never hear me say, this company hasn't even started yet. I'm so excited to get going with it. You don't hear me saying stuff like that. So this, from my point, guys, this is why I would do it. Okay. And I'm not saying this is why I do it. So this is why I think you should do it. I'm saying this is why I do it. Okay. Is because if we look to the past at S Group and the odds that that uh, S Group has shown to us with the past thing that's it's done, as you can see here on my screen, guys, all these opportunities, you know, even if, for instance, SIPO, okay, when Vadim did a webinar, I think it was, I don't know, six, eight months ago, I remember him, well, I don't remember him saying, but I remember looking at the text of what he was saying there at that webinar was that, you know, he wasn't really happy with the SIPO results, but then I'm thinking, I went in that, I made money, I made, you know, I, I put in 500 bucks in it. And then over the year, I think I made $94, which if you go look at the other opportunities in S group, that's not the best, but still I made money and I got my 500 bucks back, right? From that investment. Like I decided to withdraw and then put it into one of the Forex directions there, right? So I made $94 in it. I got my 500 back. I put it in some other Forex uh, 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 direction there. And, you know, overall, every uh, investment throughout S Group, like, you know, that's normally the one that people would think, okay, that didn't do as good. So if you just look at the overall, what S Group has put out, what they've done, guys, okay, you're looking at, you know, 90 something to 100% success rate. So, by basing judgment off that, like the past, looking to the past, how successful has this company been with the things it's rolled out? Have you made money in them? And the answer is always yes, guys. It's yes. Okay. And if things are not good or they don't like something, you hear them talk about it. You hear the, you hear the leaders talk about it, like I just did. You hear Vadim talk about, you know, SIPO in the uh, uh, one of the webinars that he did. And also the um, liquidity mining, right? He talked about that he wasn't 100% happy with the results of it because it went from 30 to 10%. But hey, I was investing that. I still made more money than I put in. Well, way more money than I put into it, right? So that's what I would say to the people out there that are like myself and they're looking at this and they're like, okay, S Group's rolling out this new opportunity. It deals with, you know, basically it's a launch of a product and you know, you're in the same position as me where you're kind of not known for promoting launches. That's not really your thing. You don't really like messing with stuff like that. You like to mess with, you know, proven systems that, you know, you can, you know, feel confident telling people about and all that kind of stuff, guys. So with this, this is a different situation um, than that. It's, it's, it, yes, it's a launch, but it's a launch from a company that's successful. Okay. So for instance, like this, you could take Tesla and use Tesla, the car company, as an example in the same manner is that, you know, if Tesla is going and they're launching a new car, do you have a feeling that car will be successful, right? Yes. 
Do you remember, maybe not, but I remember years and years ago when they first launched the Model S, okay? I'm talking about Tesla because I love Tesla. We actually have two Teslas, right, in the house here. So uh, when they launched the Model S, there was a ton of people, you know, saying, oh, this isn't going to work. Who's going to buy EV cars? And, you know, this... This is, this is just crazy, like driving around with a battery, <laughs> you know, this is crazy kind of thing like that. And then now you go out and I would say every 20th car you see, well, at least in Canada and the US, like every 20th car you see, guys, is it's a Tesla or it's an EV. They're all over the place now, right? Okay. So based upon that, this is what I'm saying is that if something is, is successful, and you've seen in that company success over and over and over again, then the odds of them rolling something out and it being successful is successful, right? Okay, so I want you guys to think about that because I know going into this and myself promoting, that's gonna be one of the things that people are asking. They're gonna be like, why would I do this when there's 10,000 other bots out there that I could use, okay? And we'll get into more you know, why I believe that S group is going to be different, or I shouldn't even say S group, but the new, you know, bot platform here is going to be different than what we're seeing out there in the market that honestly, I, I've tried a lot of stuff guys, and I just don't really see how it works or, or anything like that. Um, from my past experience with using bots or, you know, signal groups and all that kind of stuff. I, I really believe this is going to be different because S group always puts out something that's different and for some crazy reason, everything seems to work out um, to the uh, members' favor and stuff, right? Okay, so uh, we'll get going here to the next slide. And, and yeah, I, I think that's really important, guys, to think about what I just said there, right? Okay, especially if you're promoting. Okay, so handle your funds. So this is one big thing that Vadim went over there is, uh, you know, are you scared of trust management investing? Meaning something along the lines of, you know, traditional investing through your bank, you're handing your funds over, you're not really understanding how the profits are being made, you're not the one making the profits, you can't see what's actually going on, you can't see that, you know, for instance, I know both of my parents have big, you know, that's their retirement is through their bank. That's traditional, you know, if you're 60, 70, 80, um, you know, you're probably not doing online things, you're getting your retirement funds and you're going to your bank, you're getting your whatever settlement from selling your house or whatever, moving into an old folks home, you're taking those funds, you're putting them to, into an investment through your bank or financial advisor, right? So that kind of investing, you don't know what's going on with your funds, right? You don't know. And, and here's something I'll say here too, is, is that with S Group, it's kind of along the lines, the same thing, because you're not the one trading. You're, you know, what you're doing is you're going and you're, someone else is handling the funds for you, okay? So, that's something that'll be a very, very strong selling point for this bot platform, guys, is that they can see everything. The user can see everything. They're there. They, if they have a loss, they're going to understand why they have a loss. OK, so here's a perfect example. And we'll use S group for this. I think it's good to use S group as examples because you guys watching this are S group members um, is that when we do have not even a loss, but a low day in S group, what do you see? Okay, I know the majority of members, they're positive, they're happy, they're like, this is, you know, amazing, we're, we're making profit off our investment, this is great. But you do see those members leaving pukey faces, pukey emojis, thumbs down, all that kind of stuff, because they, they're like, why is there a low day? I don't understand why, you know, every day should be perfect kind of thing like that. And they don't understand that you know, market market effects are uh, profits in S group. Um, a lot of uh, things uh, affect uh, the profits in S groups and, and that type of thing, right? So with this, you know, you're going to see everything. You'll understand why you didn't have a profitable trade. You'll understand why maybe even your trade came out in a loss, that type of thing. You'll understand everything because you're the one, you know, you put the funds in that account that bot is uh, 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 doing the trading and stuff. Sorry, someone just messaged me. I gotta make sure that everything is fine here with the recording, guys. I have a question. Questions are gonna be after this, guys. I actually have a screenshot that says you can you can ask questions. So you gotta wait till the presentation's uh, done there, okay? So 
Um, yeah, I'm just looking at my phone here, <laughs> making sure everything's fine with the recording, okay? Uh, you're managing uh, the balance on the exchange, okay? So that just goes along right along those lines of what I was saying, guys. You have full control over the funds in your account. So when it comes to promoting, we'll use S Group once again, for example. When it comes to uh, promoting S Group, guys, that's one of the things that discourages people from joining S Group, okay? And I'm not saying these to bash S Group or anything. I'm saying this because you guys are S Group members. Most likely, if you're watching this, presentation, you're thinking of promoting, um, you know, the opportunity or you, you promote S group type thing and you understand, you know, you can relate to this stuff. The biggest, you know, reason why people don't join S group or they're interested in it and then they decide, yeah, I'll wait, I'll whatever, I'll, I'll think of something else or I'll do something else or whatever is because they, they don't see how profits are being made. They're just hearing about how they're being made, right? In the presentations, they're hearing that from their sponsor, okay? So you're managing the balance on the exchange, okay? So that's a very, very strong point when promoting this is, is they have full control over the balance on their exchange. They could buy the, the uh, technology, the bot. They could use it for one day. They could be like, I didn't like you know, I didn't like whatever. They have some problem with it or something. They don't like it. Guys, they can go and leave. They can take all their funds out of their account and leave. They don't have to wait three months. They don't have to, like, if you've ever heard the story about myself with my traditional banking investment, um, I uh, about seven, eight, well, probably be about nine years actually now, um, I put uh, $21,000 into a retirement fund for myself. And, you know, the goal was leave it in there until I'm 60, 70, whatever. And then, you know, it turned into actual something, right? So uh, about seven years or so, it was in there. And uh, it, it, it went from, I forget exactly what it started off with, but anyways, it, it, it came to about $21,000. And I decided to withdraw it and do something else with it right? And it ended up costing me like seventeen or $16,000. That's what I got back out of it, right? Okay. So with this here, guys, you're not paying like a 30% fee three months later, or you're not like the example, what I was saying there with, with my uh, bank there is like seven years later, they still charged me $4,000 or whatever it was to get my funds out or something like that. You could buy the technology, use it for one day, decide, Hey, I don't like this and then just take the funds out of the exchange if you don't like it, right? So, you know, the availability to do that, that's pretty awesome if you think about it there, okay? So next thing here, uh, balance is all accessible, accessible, uh, no fees um, to hold your balance. So you're not paying to hold your fees there. I know that some exchanges, you know, they'll go and they'll charge you, I don't know exactly what it's called, but they'll charge you a fee to hold your funds uh, in the exchange for you. Okay, so they're not going to do that, which is really nice. And then, um, you know, uh, liquidities can be provided like the same style as the top um, exchanges out there, like Binance and stuff like that. It's actually the next screen here. Uh, you can see the volume. This was also, I took this from Vadim's presentation. Um, but, you know, this is the volume that, say, for instance, Binance does within 24 hours, guys. Okay, so this is going to be a very, and I, I believe this is why Vadim showed this screenshot is because he wanted people to visually see how much income and how much uh, funds and stuff goes through these exchanges. Okay, so I don't think, you know, our exchange will be anything like this just because these are well established. You know, I know that I think Kraken's been around since, am I saying it right? I don't even, oh yeah, since 2011. So, you know, most of these have been around for years and years and years type thing. But you can see guys, some of these top ones, it's just insane. Like we're talking billions of dollars uh, per day or hundreds of, of millions of dollars per day is going through these, right? And then you look at the fees here, okay? So for instance, we'll just take Binance because everyone knows what Binance is. So a maker and a taker, so the, that basically means like buyer and seller, right? Okay, so a maker, they're charging a 2% fee, okay? A 4% fee would be the taker. So when you go and you uh, place a trade or you go and you sell a trade, okay? That's the percentage that they're paying, 
okay, as the trader. So the exchange, that's how an exchange makes money. So it was very, very, guys, Vadim is extremely transparent when it comes to him showing us a new business opportunity or, hey, this is what I'm thinking, this is the plan type thing like that. So he's basically showing us how on his end, um, you know, he's gonna, I don't wanna say he's gonna make money, but how the company would make money, right, okay? Because we're gonna get into the comp plan and the bonuses and commissions, and you have to understand this stuff here, right? How the company's gonna make money to understand how they're gonna do these commissions and bonuses because it is pretty, uh, it's, uh, I'll say phenomenal. <laughs> it's pretty nuts, guys, when we get into that. Okay, so here's some stuff here um, about uh, possibilities, okay? So for instance, uh, at the webinar, Vadim kind of talked a little bit about this, was that, you know, say you wanted to go and do some really uh, risk risk uh, 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 trading there, guys. Like use uh, high high uh, uh, aggression here, meaning high risk, basically, and go for like a twenty percent return on your trades. So, for instance, say you have ten thousand dollars in your trading account, and you want to allocate, you know, seventy percent of that, so seven thousand dollars to your trades, and then you'd have two to two thousand sitting on the balance. That would be like. I would say pretty high risk, right? You're using 70%. And then on top of that, you're, you're trying to get a 20% return on, on uh, each trade there that you're placing, okay? So that would be like a really aggressive uh, strategy. So he just kind of gave an example of what I just said there is that, you know, you can go and, and do really aggressive um, trading or you can go and do something that's more moderate, like trying to get a, a one to 2% um, goal on your trades. Okay. So these bots will be, you'll be able to set them up to your liking. It's not like it's going to come to you and you know, it's set at 0.30% per day and, and, and that's it basically kind of thing. You can kind of go with, Hey, I want to take some high risk here. And, uh, you know, you can have your bot settings to, um, high risk, right? Okay. So, and also he said this guys, this is actually exactly what he said in the webinar there in the, in the translation. Um, was as we test the bot technology and see good results, everyone will be convinced of its reliability. So right there, he's talking about, you know, if we simply as S group members, right, test this thing out and, uh, you know, we share our results publicly, which is what it's promotion basically, um, then that'll attract new people to it. So that line right there told me that this is not just hey, you refer people into S group and then, you know, they have an option to go do this trading bot as well. But the trading bot guys, I call it trading bot um, there, but I know it's try AIX, uh, uh, try AIX, right? So, um, uh, it, it, you know, you'll be able to go and use this as your own tool to promote, okay? So, you, you know, you could just promote this if you want, okay? So for instance, myself, I'll be, of course, promoting S group, probably focused on prime, and I'm gonna promote this as well. So I'm gonna make an entirely different sales funnel for you know, just this product because it does cater to a totally different market than S group, right? As we talked about there before was managed funds. That's basically what S group is. This is not really managed funds. You can see everything that's going on and you can decide, hey, yeah, I wanna, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna take $1,000 and I'm gonna do really, really high risk on this because it's $1,000 I don't need at the end of the month. I'm gonna allocate this $1,000. I'm gonna try and make 20% per my trade and I'm gonna use 70% of my funds when I'm trading. Like you could use, you know, that kind of high risk. So that is something else there to think about, guys, is that you could go and you could, um, you know, promote promote them uh, uh, separately if you want. So that'd be a pretty cool idea there, right? Okay, so uh, bot technology. So this is the second half of the presentation. So we're halfway through here. I hope you guys are enjoying this and I hope that you're uh, taking in some, some information here that you find is valuable, okay? So we'll start off with uh, bot uh, technology. We're gonna talk a little bit about bonuses and commissions. Um, I don't have all the information on this just yet, guys. So we'll have to wait till the, uh, which I'll talk about in this presentation here. Uh, we'll have to wait for the event in Dubai um, to get more information on the bonuses and commissions, but I'll share with you guys what I know so far, okay? Token system, which has already started. Um, I invested in that, and I think a handful of people on my team also got going with it, which is really nice. And basically that, you know, it really helps the 
uh, system get going, guys, if, if you're uh, an investor in it, um, in the token, the startup kind of thing, right? Okay, purchasing the tokens, and then, uh, you know, like what the future holds uh, for this. And then we're, we're going to open for questions at the end there. So we're almost at the questions part, guys. I, I have about five people messaging me, asking me questions. <laughs> so just hold on and be patient there, guys. Okay. So uh, bot technology here, uh, full control over your trades. We already talked about that. Um, you know, you can see everything that's going on. I'll just say that, right? Okay. One time purchase uh, for the bot technology. Okay, we're going to talk more about that a little bit later here. And then uh, only fee you'll have is the exchange fee. So the, you know, buying and selling the, the fee that the exchange is making off you when you place a trade or you sell your trade, that type of thing, the, the uh, taker and all that kind of stuff, right? Okay, your balance is always accessible. We talked about that a lot. Um, I, I think you guys are all clear on that and uh, uh, see all open trades uh, that the bot technology is managing. So really guys, I just really want you to focus and think about that you can see everything, right? You can see the funds you have in there, you can see what's in your trades, you can see what the bot is doing, all that kind of stuff, right? Okay, so next slide here. So this is the one where um, we're definitely going to get more information about this at that Dubai event, guys. Uh, also, I'll say that the the D Dubai event, um, I know in the webinar that Vadim did, he, uh, he said that it was going to be in September, guys, um, but they've actually decided to make it in October. So this more information we're talking about, uh, it'll come out probably, uh, you know, at that, well, most likely, yes, at that event. In, um, it's going to be in October now. And I think Sergi said the middle of October or something like that. They don't have a date set yet, but they're just, um, you know, they're putting things together. And I, I just, guys, I like, why am I doing a presentation on this? Because I think it's going to be really, really big. Okay. And I just want to get the word out there for you guys. So you're all on the same page. Okay. So um, here's an example here of the bonus and commission structure, which when I first heard this, I was like, how the heck are they going to do that? That's great. Like, I think of S group as a, you know, crazy, like this is too much, right? Like, like I'm making a 15% commission. Uh, I think Sergi's at like 16 point something now or something like that. Like it just seems too much, too much commission. And then, and then you go and you look at the bonuses that the company gives. And I'm just talking about S group right now. Like, you know, when I first joined, they had a million dollar bonus. That was like the top of things, right? Now they've got millions and millions and millions of dollars of bonuses at these upper levels of, of the company, right? And only one person's hit those levels so far. But, you know, if one person does it, then others are going to follow, right? So this here, if you're thinking, you know, you look at most companies out there, guys, they do cruises for their top leaders, bonuses, they do diamond rings, they do, you know, uh, like I've been in a company that, you know, we got BMW, like things like that, right? Okay. So S group, uh, <laughs> you get a lot of people looking at it and you're like, that can't be real, right? This here, guys, this takes it to a whole other level. It's, I'm going to say it's freaking bananas. Okay. It's 2x of what S group is in the commissions and bonuses and stuff. Okay. So think of this. I'll take uh, myself, for example, here. Okay. So I'm at 15% in S group. So I would be at 30% in the exchange. Guys, 30%. So the commission of a sale of a bot would be 30% commission is insane. So say, for instance, you're at like 13% right? You'd be at 26% commission. That's a lot. That's a guys, that's, that's, it, it's freaking incredible. But then if you go back and you look at that slide, we'll go back to it because I, I really want you guys to understand this. It's way back up here. But if you look at this, what I was talking about and you see the daily volume and, and I, I'm not saying, Hey, our exchange is going to do anything near this, but even if it does say a hundred million in a month in four years from now or something like that, guys, even if it's at that level, it's making like hundreds of thousands of dollars in, in fees and stuff, right? Okay. So you look at this and, and you can understand how they can do, you know, if they just stick on on uh, uh, track and stuff like that with, with everything they're putting out, you can understand how they're going to be able to do this 30%, how they're going to be able to do, uh, you know, someone coming in and, and they're, 
you know, 9% or something like that, and they're getting an 18% commission of a sale of the bot inside, uh, uh, inside the exchange there, guys. And also, you got to think, too, that, um, you know, the commission is coming from the actual sale of the bot, okay? So, for instance, if someone buys, like this example here, uh, for instance, someone comes along and buys a $10,000 bot, okay, you'll receive, in this example of 15%, which is now 30%, you'd receive a $3,000 commission for a sale of a bot, okay? So you might be thinking right now, because I know I had some people on my team message me and say, it sounds like a one-time sale. Guys, it's not a one-time sale, okay? You sell the technology, which is the bot, and then they use it, right? And if they like it, they continue to use it, okay? So if they continue to use it for the second year, then they're paying a subscription fee to use it, okay? So for instance, I don't know exactly what those subscription fees are gonna be, but I think I heard something about them being 500 to $10,000 a year, which makes sense. Say for instance, you have a $10,000 a year subscription fee, you're trading on $100,000, your, these are just numbers, guys, don't base anything off this, but say you're making 1% a day or 0.75% a day on average. I don't know. It could be less, could be more, whatever kind of thing, right? Um, you know, then you're making much more than you even have in your trading account uh, per year and you're only paying $10,000 to do that, okay? Of course, there's going to be that a little bit of stress involved, but the bot is taking away most of the stress. You can actually see what's going on. You can see when a trade is not doing good, you can see, oh, that's not doing good. You start to get those feelings and stuff like that, right? But, you know, it, it's just a learning curve that you have to get over kind of thing. And we'll talk more about that kind of stuff probably in later um, webinars and stuff right there, guys. So this is pretty exciting when you think about it, guys. And you can see like how lucrative this business is going to be, okay? So here's something else I'll add to this, which is right here um, that I was you know, taking in the text from what Vadim was talking about at the webinar. And it, it gave me this moment of like, what? Like, did I really just read that? Like, is that actually what he said? And then I went and I had to confirm this in, I think it was the 14% group, you know, after that webinar, Sergi was in there answering all our questions and stuff like that. Is this guys, from the bots, this is crazy. This is absolutely nuts. From the bots that you sell, you're going to earn a percentage of what they earn. <laughs> okay. So think of that. That is, it, it's probably not going to be huge. It, I don't think it'd be huge. Like it's not, not going to be like how the company works where, you know, S group where you deposit a hundred bucks and you're making 50% and the company's making 50%. It'd probably be nothing like that. Like that, that would just be insane. But think of that. Every bot that you sell, you're making this big, huge 2x commission basically on the bot. And then of course, they're going to continue to use it. So then you're making that per year basically off your sales of your bots. So if you, if you just focus on selling the bots, say you sell four a month, you know, in three years, you've got a really nice residual commission of thousands of dollars per month type thing in just bot sales, right? But then on top of that, you're earning a percentage of the product, uh, uh, a profit that each bot you've sold is making. And you think about this, some of these guys out there are going to be buying the 10,000, like for instance, myself, I'll buy a $10,000 bot, right? Okay. They're going to be buying those $10,000 bots, which means they're trading on, you know, I don't know if it's exactly $10,000. That's just an example, right? As I keep on saying, the, this is, this is, it hasn't launched or anything yet. So we don't know exact prices and stuff yet. Right. So, um, uh, as I was saying here, guys, if if someone's buying such an expensive bot, do you think they're trading on a thousand dollars and they're making a dollar fifty a day or or three bucks a day or something? No, they're probably trading on hundreds of thousands of dollars if they're buying that kind of bot to pay that kind of uh, month or uh, yearly fee. Um, so that means that the profit you you'd be making off the percentage that that bot is earning would probably be pretty uh, you know pretty nice, right? So think of that. You do that ten times over a year. And that could turn into, you know, a nice little income stream for yourself as well. So there's something to think about. And then, as I said here, guys, more information will be shared in Dubai. And I just want to say this, that any numbers I say in here, like I just said, you know, like there says 10,000 on my screen, this says 3,000 or something. This is what I was saying at the start of the, the presentation, guys, is maybe things will change. 
um, all that information kind of thing. So if I say numbers, don't take it as, oh, there's going to be a $10,000 bot. Okay, I'm just giving examples. And that's kind of like what Vadim was doing at the webinar as well was, was uh, talking like that. Okay. So next thing here is token system. Hopefully you guys are still with me. This has <laughs> been, been quite a while here. We're already 38 minutes into this. I'll try and uh, get going here and, and not do as much of my blah, 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 blah. But uh, token system here, guys, this has already started. I participated in, and as I said, uh, some uh, of my team members participated in as well. Okay, so minimum purchase is 250, maximum purchase is uh, 2,500. Uh, that was involved with the first round, which has already taken place. Okay, so I want to explain this to people because I, I noticed that when I first started talking about this in my team group, some people didn't get it. They're saying, why would I do this? Right. And if you've, you, you know, you can visually see why you'd want to do it because it's an investment opportunity. And then here's something else that someone in my team group pointed out was it's an investment opportunity. You're going to make money from it. But here's another thing is you're actually helping the company out get started. Okay. So I think that's an important thing too, as well is that, you know, like think about it. Most people watching this video, probably all of you have made a lot of money with S group, right? So just taking part of this token sales and stuff, guys. And even if you're doing one round, two rounds, or three rounds of it, like you're helping the company out, you're helping them get started, which is really, really good. Okay. So I think that's a message that you should put out to your team is, is, is that as well is that you're helping the company out when you invest in this stuff. Okay. So first round here, 3.7 million. You guys got to stop messaging me. Okay. After this, we'll do questions and answers. I'm just looking at my phone. It's all blue now. <laughs> okay. Uh, the first round here is 3.7 million tokens, guys. The cost of it, this is where you can see that, you know, how you'd make money in it here um, is, is uh, 0 0.30, so uh, uh, 30 cents there, okay, per token, okay? So if you spend, say, 250 SGCT, you're getting, like, I think it was 833 um, tokens uh, uh, to participate, okay? So tokens there, okay? Second round is 5 million tokens, the cost of 0 0.40. So you can see there, guys, within the first round, it's already went up 10 cents from compared to the first and the second round, okay? The third round here is 6 million tokens, and each token's going to cost 0 0.50, okay, there. So basically 50 cents. So let's think about it this way. This is 50 cents. This is 40 cents. This is 30 cents. And here's the thing. So uh, some people might think, be thinking, okay, well, I understand investing in the first round, if you're only thinking about making money, right? I understand about investing in the first and the second round, but why would I invest in the, the third round if I don't see a fourth round? Like I don't, I don't see that the tokens are going to be valued more than 0 0.50, okay? This here, if you go back to the, and this is, once again, this goes back to that slide about, you know, look, look at its past, right? Like look at this company's past. You can see that, you know, look at STD token, look at SWP token, those kind of things, guys, you can see where they start off and where, where they, I don't want to say they end because they haven't ended, right? But where they come, right? They always start off a dollar, below a dollar or something like that. And then now they're valued at a dollar and a half or a dollar and 30 cents or something, right? So they always become something more than that final third round of, of uh, purchase, okay? So if you, once again, just look to the past. If you're unsure about something, Look to the past of something. It's it's like in trading when they say, if you're unsure, look to the left, <laughs> okay, to so look at the past, right? What happened, kind of thing like that, okay? So uh, here's something else. If you participate in the first round, you can also uh, join the second round and so on. So you got to participate in the first round to be a part of the second round. To be a part of the third round, you have to be in the first and the second round, okay? So that's something else to think about there. And then here's some more information about the system tokens. As soon as the platform launches, people will receive 10% of their tokens right away. So you can get 10% of the, the token uh, 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 back right away, guys. And you got to remember, it's coming back to you at like, it'll be valued, I would think, over 50 cents. And then say, for instance, you bought at 30 cents, right? So right there, you're making money. Um, off that, maybe even making almost as much as you put into it, right? Think about that. It's pretty exciting, okay? Uh, and then it continues at 2% for 45 weeks, okay? So, you know, pretty far out there, you're going to be earning something. And we saw this with, you know, the STD and, and um, SWP and all that kind of stuff. Um, we saw that same outcome and, and, you know, we all made money from that. Good, okay? 
So benefits uh, for holders, more tokens on the balance, lower fees you pay. So that basically means that if you decide to hold, as this word says here, okay? So hold, if you hold the token in the exchange. So you can think about this token, uh, you can think about it similar to say BNB, okay? Binance's token. So if you are trading on Binance and you're using BNB in your, you know, when you, uh, to pay your fees and stuff like that, you're, you're paying less fees, okay? So you could think about it in that way that if you decide to hold these tokens or say, for instance, you're getting started and, you know, you go and you buy a bunch of the tokens, um, not to trade on, but just to hold, uh, you can pay uh, the fees of, you know, the buying and selling fees and stuff with that token, okay? And we're going to get into something else here, which you can actually buy with the token. Um, I believe it's on the next slide, okay? So paying fees and tokens, uh, additional uh, discounts there, okay? So uh, monthly bonuses for token holders. I This was all what was said about this, guys. I don't know what the monthly bonuses would be, but maybe there's something, actually, I shouldn't say maybe stuff, right? <laughs> okay, so you can just imagine maybe what that would be, okay? And then later on, we'll hear what it actually is, okay? But I'm sure it's, it's good, okay? So uh, next thing here, guys, is you can actually purchase the bots with the tokens if you've uh, participated in all three rounds of the um, of uh, the tokens there, okay? So if you went in the first round, the second round, and the third round there, you can actually, uh, you know, and if you have enough tokens, of course, the value of them, you can purchase the trading bots with those tokens there. And then the last thing here is what the future holds, okay? So we're talking about, you know, the information that's gonna come out, um, at the October 14% plus event in Dubai. I'm gonna do my very best to go, guys. Um, you know, it's, it's uh, as you guys know, I have a son. He, uh, I don't know if you know this, but he plays like rep soccer and stuff like that. So it's four days a week. Like he wants to be a soccer player. So four days a week, you know, I'm pretty damn busy, but I'm gonna do my best to make sure I can be at that event, okay? And then, you know, I'll try and get the information to you guys kind of thing, okay? Uh, if not, I'm sure there's going to be other people there that speak English that can help out and stuff, okay? So um, they will show uh, in more detail. So they're going to show in more detail, guys, everything that I've talked about here. They'll go over, like, I couldn't really talk about numbers or anything like that or, like, how much blah, 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 you know, all this stuff is uh, type thing, guys, just because that those details were not really sh uh, shared at the VADM webinar. And um, I did ask in the 14% group about details and Sergi said that that information isn't out yet. So it's going to be out at the uh, Dubai event. So we just basically, if you have any questions about how much stuff is or, you know, things like that, guys, um, it'll be answered at a later time. Okay. I think that's exactly actually what Sergi says. It'll be answered at a later time. Okay. So they're going to, at the event, guys, they're going to show testing of the bot trying to rush myself. I got to slow down. <laughs> uh, they're going to provide trainings. Um, there will be lots more information at that time. So once again, if you have questions, think about is your question relevant for now based upon the information I've shared in this video, then ask your question. Okay. Um, the cost will range from 500 to 10,000 a year for the bot technology. Okay. So I'm guessing like maybe the bot would be $500 and then you pay $500 a year for the technology. And I shouldn't say guess, let's just wait till um, the event and we get that information. But this has been put out guys that this is how much the yearly subscription fee is gonna be is 500 to 10,000. So we just need to know like roughly, is that the cost of the bot or, or you know, whatever type thing, okay? 